You want a beer? Um, two pints of your strongest lager. And one for the boy as well. Sorry. Excuse me. How are you, Janice? Great. Really good, thanks. On holiday with my family, my husband and my family. Oh, listen, am I upsetting you? No, you're not upsetting me. I... Johnny, the last time I saw you, I was a girl. A 17-year-old girl. You know, it's just weird seeing you after all this time. All of a sudden, I'm back there. It's 1984. 1984, and... It's the end of the summer, and I ask you to marry me, and you say no, and you break my heart. Well, we've both had long enough to get over it. Well, i uh, better get off. Uh, back to work. Back to the UK tomorrow. Uh, how, how's your mum? What a strange thing to ask. You never met her. I know, but I knew all about her. This is probably why I never met her. My mother's in her 70s. I just wanted to come home, but she's determined to stay out here. Says she wants to run another business out here. She said, that Bruce Forsyth is still working. He's in his 90s. I told her, no, he can't be. He's still got all his own hair. <laughs> Sorry, I'm waffling. Why did you say no, Janice? Because I'm sure he's nowhere near 90. We saw him on the telly the other week. He sang Mr Bojangles and did the splits at the end. Why did you say no when I asked you to marry me? What? You think if I'd said yes, we'd still be living happily ever after? Went to the cinema on my own. What? The last time we were supposed to meet, you know, when you didn't turn up. Against all odds. Quite apt, really. Johnny. You were going to say something. Take care of yourself. Wait your turn. Shh. I saw you. Earlier on? Did you? Yes. You were making eyes at that girlie. She's through there, isn't she? I, I don't think she... I um... don't think she what? Come on, spread it, Dad. I don't think she likes me. No, b****. You want a beer? Um, Two pints of your strongest dagger. And one for the boy as well. Sorry. Excuse me. Let me give you some advice, Sonny. What you have to do is just go in there and lay your cards on the table. None of this playing hard to get at being cool. A woman likes to know where she stands. Flattery. That's what you need. That's been nice to someone, isn't it? Oh. Mm. <clears throat> They've been nice. Nice doesn't come anywhere close. You're dealing with women here. You've got to make her feel as though she's the most beautiful creature who ever drew breath. Tell her. We like to be treated like ladies. Made to feel special. Hmm. Tried. You'll be surprised at the results. What bloody hell's going on here? 